Hi, George here. In this video, I wanted to share a few thoughts on what I think is the most important thing in running training. And uh, this might be uh, boring, but I think the most important thing is consistency. Um, so a lot of people get um, too carried away with analyzing an individual workout and then uh, um, not really consider what the training was like leading up to that. So for example, um, someone is dissatisfied with their uh, long run or the uh, um, joint started aching in the long run. And uh, they then try to get tips on how to uh, get uh, uh, rid of those uh, aches and everything. And uh, you know, people might be very helpful and uh, provide some, some good uh, tips and responses. But actually, if we look at what that runner has done uh, in the week and weeks leading up to that long run, was that consistent enough to actually let the body uh, be in a place where uh, the body can happily do a, a long run of uh, 10, 15, 20k? And uh, in that uh, those particular cases, my um, thought would be no, right? Uh, because if um, if the if there had been consistency, then um, and gradually increase in the load on the uh, on the uh, musculoskeletal system, then there wouldn't be any um, joint aches, right? For a gen generally um, healthy person and a runner who is um, uh, has been consistently building up to that uh, distance, then um, joint aches uh, are extremely unusual. It uh, shouldn't really happen. So uh, what we want to do is week on week uh, when you when you start uh, running, right? We we increase the volume by about ten percent week on week because um, our musculoskeletal system is slow to respond. And uh, that's where um, usually the complaints come from. The complaints don't usually come from um, the, the intenseness of uh, a workout and not being able uh, to cope. Because you know, you, when you do um, a speed work session, uh, you run as uh, fast as you need to run, uh, as fast as you can run, but your cardiovascular system is quick to respond. So next time you do the same workout, you'll be able to go a little bit faster and a little, a little bit faster and a little bit faster. Um, but where the complaints usually come from are uh, aches and muscle aches and joint aches and so on and so forth. And that's because those are all musculoskeletal issues and that system in the body needs time to respond and needs that consistency and then gradual build up. Um, so running um, a short run in one week and then not running for uh, another week and then doing a long run two uh, weeks later is unlikely to uh, be a pleasurable experience, right? But if somebody is uh, doing a uh, an easy run uh, during the week and a slightly longer run on the weekend and they do it consistently and build it up gradually, then they'll be able to enjoy the long run some more. So we need that consistency um, uh, week and week and week and week and uh, month and month and just build it up slowly and gradually. And that will lead to a lot more enjoyment. Um, so if you have got any thoughts on this uh, subject um, or please leave uh, them in the comments and ideas for future videos, also please leave them in comments. Um, uh, if if there was something useful in this uh, um, uh, in this video for you, please hit the like button. If you'd like to get updated on new videos, please hit the subscribe button. Um, other videos should pop up uh, here. And uh, in the meantime, I hope that your running training is going well and uh, wish you happy running. And uh, you'll see uh, uh, more next time. Thank you very much. Bye bye.